Hi, this is Rakesh and you are watching Royal Technology. In this video, we will show you if you are facing this issue on your HP laptop that uh, HP is your key recovery or uh, uh, recovery boot failure. So, how you can fix? Maybe you are facing this kind of issue in any other laptop also. So, just follow the steps. Power off uh, the laptop uh, completely and uh, wait some time and then turn it on again and uh, wait and uh, see whether it is coming again or not so if that fix okay if not then we'll move to next step so just uh, see carefully what exactly i am doing so if you have any doubt comment below we will reply to all the comments and it is uh, booting up so it is taking some time so once boot we'll see as you can see it is uh, coming again so what now you have to do uh, it is uh, showing a uh, boot device not uh, found or something so uh, it is related to your uh, hard disk or ssd only so uh, turn it off again there is a chance that your uh, hard disk or ssd is uh, faulty or maybe because of the dust it is happening so let's turn it on again and uh, keep on pressing the f12 key if you have the hp laptop if you have any other laptop you can search on google which key is used to uh, go inside the bios so for hp it is f12 so i'm pressing it continuously so it will take me inside the bios so we will check the boot sequence and uh, the boot devices so it will take some time keep on pressing okay so as you can see uh, i'm inside uh, uh, um, BIOS now boot menu and if I skip so it will show all the um, BIOS related options so over here I have to select boot menu and then it will show all the uh, devices if you uh, have a pen drive hard disk or uh, other uh, things like a network boot so all the details it will show so as you can see there is no hard disk or ssd is showing that means there is a um, issue with the hard disk or ssd so uh, just turn it off and uh, we'll move to next step so i am forcefully shutting down so now what we will do we will uh, open the back panel and uh, we'll check the ssd so there are six to seven screws at the back so let me unscrew all the screws quickly and uh, as you can see uh, this is our ssd left hand side this is ssd so there is one screw let me unscrew it and uh, we will uh, clean it carefully and then uh, put it back so if you are uh, not comfortable doing all these things so you can visit a uh, uh, nearest uh, uh, shop and uh, take help from the vendor and uh, check these things uh, so after cleaning uh, let's check whether it is booting or not so as you can see the same error it is still coming so the thing is the issue is with the ssd so finally i have replaced the ssd i forgot to shoot the video but i have replaced the ssd and also installed the operating system so as you can see it is booting now and the OS is fully loaded and it is working fine so if you have any doubt comment below or if you are facing any other issue you can comment we will reply to all the comments so if you are uh, new to our video do like share and subscribe to our channel thanks for watching see you in the next video